Hey guys, Dark Recycle on FPV, and I'm doing a quick video here for a customer who sent me his <coughs> excuse me, HOTA D6 Pro Dual Charger, AC-DC Charger, and what he's got, he's got a problem here, and I'm just using my battery as an example, so let me just do a split screen here and show you what we're doing, and I'm going to try a couple different fixes here, but I wanted to uh, get with you guys real quickly in case one of these fixes does work, you wouldn't be able to see the problem to begin with, so let me see if I can kind of zoom in here. Okay, so what we've got, I think I gotta keep the screen this close just so you can see the numbers on the screen here. All right, so let me show you what I've done. I've taken a, a, a LiPo that I've got in storage, and if you look right here, uh, on uh, we're using on channel one, you can see that it says that cell number two is 2.31 volts, right? So here's what happens. If I take it and I move it to channel two, just like this, and I plug it in, okay? Now we've got 3.82, which is correct. Uh, let me see if I can get you to see that. You see how it says 3.82, right? So we don't have three point, we don't show that on channel one. So what we're gonna do, first thing we're gonna do, now let me zoom out, is I've got this plugged in and I'm gonna try to do a firmware update on here first. So here's what I've done. I've so what we did, you see, now watch. Now all the cells are reading fine again, okay? So let's go ahead and stop the task. Let's eject. Okay. Now let's plug it back in. I'm going to go back to our channel one. Hold the channel button down. And what I did is I changed the... Uh, I changed the cell count. This is kind of crazy. So I went back and I changed it to like 2S, right? And it went back and changed everything and gave me my cell count again, back to normal. So it looks like all you had to do, at least in this case, was uh, go back here. I'm gonna, oops, I'm gonna stop it, okay? And now let's take this out. Wait for it to drop down. All right, now let's plug it in like this. All of a sudden we have our cell counts now. Let me zoom in on that so I can show you. Look, it's back to normal now, okay? And the only thing that I had to do after all this crud was done, all I did to do this, when it was reading incorrectly, it had two wrong, is I held the channel button down. I went to my cell count. I rolled it back to like 2S, and then I, I had it, let me go to balance here. I don't know if it'll do it on balance, but let's go to balance. Okay, and then start task, I don't know if it'll do it. But it automatically reset everything, and it gave me back my right values, okay? So now we're good. We're balanced charging, and it's back to normal, okay? So I guess at the end of the day, guys, and I mean, I was, I was thinking this was gonna be much more difficult than it was, but this was actually pretty simple. Um, I'm really surprised that's what it took. There it is, it's working. If you have any questions, as always, uh, you can hit us up here um, uh, at cyclonfpv.com. Use our contact page. I'm just getting ready to go take my kids. It's Sunday, we're gonna go have some fun. I just wanna get this done for a customer real quick. Um, as always, go spend time with your family, guys. You never know how much time you have left. Go make the most of it. You can always fly later. I'm getting ready to go have some fun too. And please subscribe to our channel below. Uh, if you have any questions, send me an email. If not, well, we'll talk to you later. Have a great weekend. God bless, guys. Bye.